टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी रोमन न्यूडल्स दिस इज रोमन न्यूडल्स एंड दिस इज हिंदू अरबिक न्यूडल्स वन टू थ्री फोर एंड सो वन इज हिंदू अरबिक न्यूडल्स एंड दिस इज रोमन न्यूडल्स आई फार वन डबल आई फार टू ट्रिपल आई फार थ्री दीज आर समाधार सिम्बल्स आई फार वन वी फार फाइव एक्स फार टेन एल फार फिफ्टी सी फार हंड्रेड टी फार फाइव हंड्रेड एम फार थाउजेंड फार थाउजेंड बी राइट एम इन रोमन न्यूब्रल्स फार फाइव हंड्रेड बी राइट डी इन रोमन न्यूब्रल्स नाव यू लर्न द Rule of writing Roman numerals. I is repeated only three times. Suppose this is I. This is repeated only three times. Suppose we want to write three. We can write one I three I one plus one plus one three. But we can not cannot write this four time. Suppose we want to write four. This is wrong. We cannot write I four times. If we want to write four, we can write in this manner. This is five. And five minus one four. If a smaller number is written to the left of a bigger number, then it is subtracted. Suppose this. This is bigger number. This is smaller number. If a smaller number is given in the left of the bigger number, then it is subtracted from the bigger number. Suppose this. This is Ten, and this is one. This means ten minus one. Ten minus one, nine. This is nine. If a smaller number is written to the right of a bigger number, then it is added. For example, this is five, and we write i from the left of v. Then it is. It will be added. This is five, or this is one. Five plus one equal to six. This number is six. We can write six in Roman numerals like this. For seven, this is five. Five plus two seven. We write double i. This is. Seven. We find that b is not written to the left of x because the smaller number is not written to the left of the bigger number. Suppose that b can write fifteen in this manner, but b cannot write x. You can also write the V L D, but it is not repeated. V L D, V for five, L for fifty, D for five hundred. These three letters use only once. We can write these letters only one time, only once in a number. And symbol I X C and M. 
can be repeated a maximum three times. D symbol can be repeated maximum three times. Symbol I can be added or subtracted from symbol V and X only. This symbol can be added and subtracted from this and this symbol. B can write in the right side of 5 in the right side of X and B can write the left side of V and left side of X. Next, the symbol X can be added or subtracted from L and C only. This symbol X, it can be added or subtracted from only L and C. B can write X left and right of L and C only. Symbol C can be added or subtracted from D and M only. This symbol C, this can be added or subtracted only D and M. Suppose we want to write 30. How we write? Thirty means ten plus ten plus ten. X plus X plus X. Ten plus ten plus ten. Right side means adding. Suppose we can write. 31 this is 30 b8 plus 1 this can be 31 x x x 1 if we want to write 19 this is 10 10 plus 9, this is 9, this is 10, and these two symbols represent 9, because this is 10, and if we want to write 9, B subtract 1 from 10, this, and same manner we can write the large numbers, suppose 4, 50. 4 means 400 and this this means 550 this number is 450 C D D for 500 if we subtract 100 from 500 it will be 400 D C and plus fifty L next if we want to write twelve hundred what is the symbol of thousand one thousand two hundred for one thousand we can write M and for two hundred we can write double C because because C can be repeated three times. Suppose this number forty nine. How we write forty nine? Forty nine means this is L fifty and fifty minus X forty or and forty plus nine. This is forty nine. We cannot write this this is fifty fifty minus one forty nine. 
49. This is wrong. Because I cannot write here. And same manner, we can add or subtract the numbers. Suppose. Plus. This means 3. And this means 5 plus 1, 6. We add the number 6 plus 3, 9. And we convert this Hindu Arabic numerals in Roman numerals. Same. In this manner, we can add or, add or subtract the Roman numerals also. Okay.